All right, guys, what's up? Brian here, Brian's All Maintenance, Launchpreneur. All right, special vlog for you guys today. Check this out. We're mowing the three acres. We're gonna be doing doing the whole deal. And who do we got here? Roberto. How we doing, bro? Doing pretty good. Yeah. Doing good, man. Always a pleasure. Uh, Rob and I. It's actually Labor Day. Labor Day. And uh, we've been mowing grass and uh, doing all of our commercial sites because Rob and I didn't want to get a full day behind. And I said, hey, do you want to help me mow this property and learn how to use the lawnmower? He said, yeah, of course I do. He said, do I have an option? <laughs> so, all right, um, why don't you grab the Z? Rob's never done it before. He's been on a little bit, but uh, we're going to we're gonna teach Rob how to use the lawnmower today. And some of you guys that are just uh, kind of getting your business started or want to learn how to use the zero turn, we're going to show you a couple tips today. So. All right, so first things first, Rob, you, you already know this, but just review yep. purposes. We've got the ignition. So you, when you do start it, obviously just a quick second and let it go. Yep. Parking brake. All right, we've got the parking brake. So you'll slam that down, pull those in. That's your neutral. Mm -hmm. Back is reverse, forward is front. One forward, one back. You're going to do a left turn, opposite other the way. other way. All right, so uh, just don't bang into anything on the way out, but if you do... I'll try my best. It is what it is, right? And don't hit the yellow button. That's the blades. Done. Push one forward and go this way. There you go. Come forward. All right, you stop. All right, you stop. Put the arms out. There you go. All right, so when you put the arms out, it'll put it into neutral, right? It kept on going down. Well, you're on a hill. Yeah. Plus, it's called the X mark creep, right? That's what I call it. <laughs> the All creep, right, yeah. the, you got the creep, right? So, mower really simply. Let's just do a little uh, walk through here. Uh, this. A uh, deck lift pin, deck uh, deck locking mechanism here. So when you, right here, put your right foot on there. So you're gonna push forward a little bit and then use your right hand and pull that down. So lift up the deck. All right, now it takes the tension off. There you go, now it drops all the way. All right, so now the deck, right? It yep. is resting at, what do we got? Three. All right, so let's uh, adjust that to four inches. So you're gonna push your foot on there, yep. Pull that pin out, or you can even flick it. Oh, dude, pull it back. back up. There you go. So it's locked. And then uh, you gotta flip the pin upwards. There you go. It'll kind of catch. You're good. Uh, lean it forward. There you go. And then we're gonna put it in at four. All right. Same thing. Now let go of the deck. Should uh, like kind of top. Yep. Drop down. All right. So the same thing. Let's grab. The, let's push uh, that. Get the tension off the pin. There you go. And drop it down. Now we're at four. Oh. Voila! Look, you're a lawn care pro. Well, look at a me. A lawn bro, lawn yeah. pro. <laughs> All right. So, uh, your left foot. That is your pedal, right? So as you can see, left, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Right. right. So anytime we come around cars, we're shooting towards the road, which we don't want to do. We flower always want beds. Yeah, flower beds. We always want to shoot inward or at least deflect it down. Mm -hmm. um, and when we mow with the X mark one, usually you gotta kinda rest your foot over there to keep it up. Cause if not, it's gonna rest down. Yeah, it's just gonna. Yeah, cause you know, we gotta mess with the, the tension cable. So, all right, now how do we mow? How are we gonna do this? So you can kinda see faintly the lines from last week. I doubt the guys in the camera can. But you see here, we got a light line. And then we got a dark, light, dark. Yep. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna line up. Right now you're you're kind of on one of the lights. We're gonna probably go a little bit further down. See that big green bush in the back? Uh, all the way back there? Yeah. All the way back there, uh, right in the middle. So oh, okay. yeah. we're going to probably come down here, a couple more passes down, and we're gonna just point at something at the far end and try to stay on it. Sure. Sound, sound, so you said- keep it straight, yeah. So we're taking bets. What do you think? You're gonna keep it straight or you're gonna go left, right, left, I'm right? I'm hoping I'm gonna keep it straight, but yeah. I was making the bet that by the end of this, your side's gonna look all clean and then my side, you're gonna have like one maybe straight <laughs> and another one just, you know, all wavy and all that. So we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes. I love it, dude. So, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this whole property and uh, we're gonna cut it right down the middle. Rob's gonna take one side, I'm gonna take the other side. I got the Starus and uh, it's gonna be bumpy, but you know, 
takes about an hour and a half to do this, hour, hour and a half. Mm -hmm. But with two guys, maybe we can short up in a half hour, 45, right? Yeah. Uh, you see my stripes from last week? Yeah. Diagonal? Yeah, this like, way. Yeah. That was from the Titan. This thing's actually grown pretty well. We got a good, what, five inches maybe? So oh, yeah. We're going to take off a good inch, inch and a half. So, all right. So a couple things. If you ever get in trouble, you always push the arms out, right? right. Push your arms out. That's neutral, mm -hmm. right? So, or bring them back to the neutral position. So oh, bring yeah. them in again. So see right here, we're neutral. That's going to stop you from going forward or back. Mm -hmm. Now, at the same point, if you're creeping forward or you're creeping back, you might have to push it a little bit forward, Just push it a little bit back. Even it out. Because yeah. the pumps are like, every, every mower is different. Mm -hmm. Some of them, are, you know, aren't so like dialed in or calibrated in, right? All right, so let's do this. Let's do a couple passes. Um, when, you, when you mow, everybody's different, but here's what we're going to do. We always do trim side, right? So this is called the trim side. Mm -hmm. This is discharge. So this is trim side. Uh -huh. So what we're gonna do is, we always wanna shoot everything inward, right? Uh, yeah. So if we're going to outline the property, here's your quiz for the day, which way are we gonna go? If we wanna outline the property, eliminate, yep, exactly. We're gonna go left, because everything's gonna point in mm -hmm. everywhere we go, right? Super simple. Yeah. So what I'm gonna have you do is, you're going to do a zero turn, come over here, outline this whole strip, right? One whole pass all the way around when you come to the mailboxes. You're going to go all the way around it, right? Go straight. And so about that yellow sign, yeah. uh, there's a pink marker on the other side of the construction sign. Yeah, I see it. All right, so when you get to that pink thing, you want to stay on this side of it. No, on the right side. Stay on the right side of it. And then I'm going to have you go all the way down. You'll see where the field kind of like is their grass and our grass. Mm -hmm. Go all the way down. You'll see another pink um, marker, uh, site marker for the survey marker. You're going to go left to that corner tree line. So it's like this way and then this way. Okay, so you got a little. Yep. And then can you see in the distance all the way over there where it's like different colored turf all the way in the distance with the neighbor mode? Yeah. So you're going to mow up to his property line. Mm -hmm. Take it all the way around the wood line, right? It kind of goes into a little bit of a swoop. Yeah. And you're going to come back all the way through here. Over there, see this little bit darker green grass? Yeah. So you're going to stay on this because that's our property. All that tall grass, you stay on this side of it. And then you're going to come down to this tree line. You might dead end to the trees and then come on this Just side. And then you go all the way down to this marker. What do you think? You think you can do it? Uh, I think I can do it. I All think right. I can try. This is your this is your moment to shine, bro. All right. Well, let's do this. So we have low rev, medium rev, and high rev. Okay. We want to always cut in medium or right. like mid power. If we have thick, wet, tall grass, X mark says to cut it in low. Can you know? You think logically you'd want to cut it in the tallest or the highest setting. That's what we do. Mm. Uh, on open field like this or thick grass, I always rev the engine up higher, but I call it turbo mode. Uh, we don't need to do that today. We got some regular weekly growth. So you're going to always cut in this. Uh, now this technology is called red tech. Uh, so the red tech means that when you plop, uh, pop that PTO, the blade engagement, the yellow button uh, yes, that. on this mower, the engine, no matter what it's revving at, it's mm. going to lower it uh, to engage the blades to put less tension and pull on the belts and the pulley. Oh, okay. Right? Yeah. So if you engage at this high level, mm -hmm. imagine that you're just instantly sucking the belt up onto the clutch, yeah. whipping that, everything like yeah. crazy. That's a lot of tension. So we mm -hmm. want to drop that down to the low or middle. This mower will automatically drop it down kind of in between actually, but right. usually at the low setting. All right. So let's give it a crank. Um, you're going to engage the blades. So be smart, be careful. If you ever get stuck, put it back in the neutral, right? Uh, yep. Smash the yellow button off and you're good to go. All right, so, and then just watch where you're and shooting. If I need to raise this up. That's it. If you see any divots or anything like that, anything crazy, you're good to go. All right, so safety first. You got your headphones? Yep. We'll put your uh, ISO tunes on. Everybody always asks, what do we use? ISO tunes. Brian's done. Going worldwide. All right, so, and by the way, when you do this, mm -hmm. just turn it for like a half second. Don't You don't have to hold it. Okay. Just a quick second, okay? All right, it's all you, brother. This is training day. Let's see if you can do it. Deck. Yep, you got four inches. All right, break. Bring them in. Let's look this way. Stop. Let's look this way. Quick tip, let's always keep both moving. So we always want to keep one forward and the other one back. That way we don't pivot and tear up the grass. Nothing bad here. You're good. So let's do this. Medium. Let's engage the blade. Here we go.
is doing it. I'm so excited for Rob. Big thumbs up if you guys are enjoying this. Uh, show Rob some love. Leave something down in the comments that says, great job, Rob. You're a natural. Show the guy some love. He's, uh, we're going through the training process. Rob's gonna probably be taking over the rig next year. Just gotta get those stripes a little bit straighter, Rob, if you're watching this. I love you, bro. <laughs> this is so cool. I love doing teaching and training and how-tos, and I think we're gonna have a whole nother chapter on the channel, teaching Rob and uh, the next guy that we also hire to take Rob's spot on how to do the business. So it's gonna be really, really exciting. I know Rob's been dying to get off the trimmer. Amen. All right, so let's watch Rob. He's going all the way down. All the way. He's gonna hit the, uh, there's a, uh, a marker, sight marker. He's gonna go left to those uh, pines. He's gonna go north. No, I guess that'd be west. But he's gonna go straight, round out the whole property, come back down and around. So that yellow button's your PTO. Yep. Yep. So smash it just like you did. What do you think? A little more bumpier than I thought it was gonna be. Trying yeah. to keep it under control, you know, speed wise. But yeah, yeah. I think I can get a hang You're of it. You're smiling, bro. Later. You look happy. I am. It's fun time. <laughs> <laughs> I was telling these guys I'm really proud of you, I'm really excited for you. And uh, yeah. you were laughing earlier, you said about keeping the straight lines. Mm -hmm. Well I was looking over there and they were uh, about as straight as a uh, uh, whatever this is and i was i was, I was laughing and then i saw you come up over the ridge and you were like ur, 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 ur. but it's all good uh, oh for, yeah because there's that bigger bush i went around it instead of going behind it yes yeah. yes all good so what do you think i mean comfortable oh yeah definitely comfortable can, yeah can only can go, go so fast with all the bumps no yeah exactly that's the whole thing i was trying to more or less figure out the whole time is the speed and keeping yep. it straight with the bumps and all that so. absolutely absolutely uh what do you think you got um better perspective just riding it just one one lap to oh, see yeah. what what i can get what you got to trim or vice versa mm -hmm. no yeah big time for sure oh. just knowing how far you can just maneuvering yep. around everything yeah the biggest thing the biggest tip is uh you can always trim mm -hmm. so getting too close to like a mower or a car yeah. or you know a sign like you know you don't want to suck anything in because once it goes under yeah exactly. game over yep. right so all right well we're gonna do this we're going to mount the uh, camera mount the gopro uh we're going to have rob do which side do you want to do you want to do this side or this side it makes really no difference uh, i don't care you want to do a test to see if you can keep it straight all the way down yeah i, I can <laughs> he already rounded out the whole property i'll, I'll try it yeah for oh, sure all right we got the rob challenge by the way big thumbs up for rob all right so Let's do this. You're gonna come uh, about over here. You see that big green shrub in the middle? Yeah, that big one. In yep. The so we're going to come over here and you're going to point at it. Follow, you can just paint the line from last uh, two weeks ago, mm -hmm. but if you just straight say point it at it, even though you go over you know, 300 feet, if you just straight point it at it, you should be good. Mm -hmm. All, right? All right? So we're gonna do a little homework, a little test. Here's your first quiz, here's your first test. <gasps> what do you think? You can do it? I, I, I think I can try for All sure. Right. So let's do this. Uh, uh, hit your brake. You got the brake. Brakes on. Brakes on. Start it up. There you go. Yep. Drop your brake. Let's get the engine up into the middle. The engine. There you go. Cool. Come on over. See this lane? That gray one, that's you. Oh, right, right here, yep. So does it matter if I keep the right or left side? Or? Nope, you wanna go right on it. Oh, right on it. So you're gonna go over and then over. Oh. So your wheels, yep. Good. All right. Right back there. You're, you're right on it. Yep. All right, so see that bush? Yep. That's your happy place. All right. All right, so you're gonna pop it, go all the way down. Now, when you ride it back, let's do this. When you ride it back, that way we don't gotta yell and everybody's like, what? That way when we ride it back, you're gonna go all the way down, turn around, and then you're going to come- On this side of on it. On this side of it, yep. And what you're gonna do is, this is what we call tip to tip. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you want this deck, when you come all the way down, 
to basically be like right here back on itself. Uh, yeah. So that way you get those cool wheel marks. Mm -hmm. Now you're not gonna do a perfect job your first time, but maybe, maybe. I'll try my best. Yeah, 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 all right. So you go all the way down, you're gonna turn it around and then you're gonna ride the next lane over. And so basically you want about, for this lane that we're doing next, mm -hmm. about two to three inches to go under here. Like the less the better, cause it's gonna give you that wide tip to tip look. All right, yeah. So you're gonna get those big like baseball diamond stripes. Mm -hmm. Okay, but if you can keep about two, maybe three inches, it's okay if we got a little bit of overlap. Yeah. That'll be good for today. All right. All right, it's so all you brother, take it away. Let's all see right. what, let's see what this guy can do. Oh, outward. You gotta take him out. There you go. Parking brake. There you go. So proud of Rob. Dude, look at that. That's actually pretty good, bro. That's it's actually a lot better than I thought it was gonna do for sure. I will agree. I, I was kind of like hesitant. I was like, ah, I saw you turn that, uh, turn the mower on uh, up there. You did a good job. Yeah. I was like, can you stick the half pipe? You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah. got a little Tony Hawk stick action. The so, what do you think? I got, of course, a couple bounces, a couple oh, left yeah. and rights. This property is super bumpy, super hilly, mm -hmm. so it's always hard to say. By the way, uh, shout out to um, the Miami landscaper because I always like talk with my hand. Mm -hmm. This is how you know you're famous if you can talk right. with your hands. I don't know, I'm just Polish, man. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do this side. You're gonna do this side, up, down, up, down. So anytime we come to a property, right, there's three parts to a zero turn, right? Mm -hmm. We got to do the outline. We got to master painting on the stripes. And the third thing, the master's turns. Uh, yeah. That's all it is to a zero turn, right? Mm -hmm. The outline, always shooting away from the home. Yep. And then you know that. And then once we go the inside of the home, shooting into the middle, yeah. we do the outline going around the outside, shooting back in. Yeah. Then it's just painting stripes. And the only way you really mess it up with the zero turn is the turns, right? We don't want the, the divots, the no, turns. Yeah. Yeah, you both have to start moving. Both gotta be moving, absolutely. So, all right, well, let's do this. We'll wrap up with some uh, some time-lapse action of us uh, painting the stripes. Uh, I just wanna say a big shout out to Rob here on this video for crushing it, bro. Thanks. Great Thanks. job, man. Okay. So we're training him, we're getting him up to speed. We're gonna be doing a lot more over the next couple of weeks. I'll leave you guys here with a couple videos here, a couple cards if you guys wanna watch a uh, how to not leave divots and then also the best way to go tip to tip to get those kind of stripes I was telling Rob about. We did some other tutorial uh, how to type videos. So, all right guys, well that's it. If you enjoyed it, big thumbs up. You enjoying it? I'm enjoying it. This guy's the man, He's, we got Foreman Rob. All right, we'll catch up with you guys on the next one.